want some all with that sauce, man? Because we just kicked up a big old pot of genuine awesome sauce. You squared off with the monkeys yet? Well, you know, I'm ahead of the curve with these elephants, but them monkeys, they gonna need a little bit more 10 or 11 care from old Herc here. Monkeys is totally bald, right? I mean, that's why they didn't make Planet of the Elephants or Jumbo Kong or Outbreak, but with elephants, it's all about the monkeys, man, the monkeys. So I'm gonna find that last statue, and when I do, we're gonna go tap bro two and do the herc on them dudes. Okay? Yeah. I knew you was with me. Right here, man, me and you. Kindred spirits.
you've secured Bogador and taken care of Noor. I have to admit, I'm very impressed. With half the fortresses under our control, it's severely limited Pagan's ability to counterattack. Please, help me. They're holding my friends hostage. You have to save them. I'll take hey, care of them. How have you been? Thank <laughs> you. 
money if you don't kill him <laughs> abey kill him you are just angry because i won There you are. I thought you'd never come back. you are i th they have my family as well please you have to save them nobody else can what are you doing
Nomad camps throughout Kiran. Great move, you guys. Yeah, way to pick on the little guys. That sucks, you know, because those guys have already had it bad enough already. I mean, think of the nomads. They sleep in heads every night, they're always moving around. That's no way to live. You guys probably have to shit in boxes. And don't even, don't even mention how these guys shower. I mean, they have to probably fill up a body and dump it on their heads like they're an animal. And you know me, I only shit in bowls. I am a toilet bowl guy till I die. And I am a bitch. My asshole is clean and a fucking whistle. You could play a tune to my asshole in that fucking clean. Kind of walk in their shoes for a moment. You're smelly, you're shitting in boxes. You're always moving, and you know I hate moving. And then at the end of the day, all you want to do is lie down, maybe rub one out, think about, think about your girl back home. And then what happens? No, no, Royal Army, we're going to pump some lead into your face and kill you and everyone that you love. That sucks. So what's the message of the day today, folks? Do not be a nomad in Kirat. And you know what the sad part is? Some of us don't even... Still alive, shit bags! Hang on, my friends! I know you're angry as Donald, but what he did for the Mirror and Body! He made trouble! And it's Yogi, you cunt! I still want to shoot you both. Uh, listen, I don't blame you for wanting to put a hole in Reggie here. Fuck, fuck it, we were trapped in this bloody country, like you, or I think Nick got passports, and they're getting us to fuck other folks, like you! And we can't go back to India after that incident with the cow. Cows are... Uh, right, cows are... Uh, Oh, so many cows. Did you hear this 10 million hits on YouTube so far? Really? Yeah, it was... Okay, look, 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 look. We... 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 We thought no one wanted to pull a. We didn't think she was gonna throw you in the arena naked. Yes, we did. That's why you bet against him. I only technically bet against him. I, I was trying to cover the spread, my old China. He means mate. I, however, had no doubt. I bet on you, mate. Check it out. Which I'm more than willing to split with you, uh, 60-40. 40-60. 37. Right, just take the whole lot. You deserve it. Fighting with your tackle flip-flopping about. Yeah. Oh, we're very impressed. With his tackle? With his fighting tit, he was very gladiator. I would say more 300. I want you two gone. I want you out of my house. I'm taking it back. And if you ever... We'll shoot Donald together. It's Yogi. Smoke? Leave. Alright. Just just give us a second to pack. Yeah, we're nesters. It's a bit of a mess. <sighs> but first. <sighs> oh. So what used to be here? One of those thankers? Yes. Clever clocks. What happened to it? Now that is a story worth telling. Yeah. Drugs, intrigue, danger. It's all there. I just want the short version. Fine, the short version. We were new arrivals in Kairat. Fresh off the boat, so to speak. Yes, and we were eager to sample the local horticulture scene. Very eager. We were not disappointed. No, not in the slightest. And it was all thanks to an, uh, a kindly old guru who helped open our minces. Right. That day, we reached a level of herbal nirvana unlike any other. When it was all said and done, we asked the guru who his supplier was. That's when we heard of Shangri-La. Shangri-La. <laughs> it's like a... The ghost of ancient Kyra. Ancient Kyra. Yeah, it's, it's more like the ghost that never was. So it's like Schrodinger's cat. <laughs> Schrodinger's Kyra. <laughs> Guys, the short version, right? Right, back on track. Um, so the guru told us he had journeyed to a storied place. And when he was there, he nipped a few buds. 
This was all made possible through a mystical thanka that hung on this very wall. So what happened to it? Uh, it was torn to pieces and scattered throughout Kairat by persons unknown. Yeah, right, but not to worry. The old geezer sold us a map that ah. led to a cave not far from right, here. Right, a cave with a scary door. Right, really scary. As much as we wanted to chase that dragon, the door had a certain uh, do not enter sort of quality to it. So where's the map? I think we used it as a rolling paper, but no worries. The, the cave is easy to find. You just head west from here. Yeah, right. And when you find a door with a really scary face on it, you know you're in the right place. Oh, yeah, and bring us back a few buds, yeah?